all right here's the help you wanted come to here come in this main section control a control c go to your steam profile edit profile go to the profile name type something you want at the start let's just put epic paste put your name paste again go down save go to your profile just like that it's in the middle now clear right at the bottom it'll look like that once it's done in the middle there magic for the long profile you come here take that paste it that save as save it to your desktop already saved it and then you go back here go to this choose file find it title put whatever you want copy this section inspect console paste it in there scroll down all the way if it's outside the screen just hold down control keep zooming out while using your scroll wheel until you can see this part make sure it's in the web you can't do that on the actual client click i created this save and continue i'll be created now when you go to your steam profile click edit feature showcase go down to your screenshots all right here we go newest one wait for that to load go down all the way save and now when i go to my profile click reload all right here we go go all the way to the top it's my main section keep going the rest of my profile and oh look there we go it blocks out the entire comment section Right, now I'm going to show you how to remove that super long screenshot showcase thing. All of that. Click on screenshots. Click on that. Open the URL. Scroll down all the way. Scroll out. Scroll down. A few times. Keep going down. So we'll lose it otherwise. All the way down. There we go. Right, delete. Okay. Right now, your profile will be back to normal. Refresh it. Scroll down there. My profile's back to normal. The next part is this invisible emoticon. So emoticons, if I go to my profile, I'll just show you quickly. Uh, these things here are the B1 emoji. They just call little small emojis which you can put. This one's completely invisible. Trouble is, it's, it's, it's a few quid. All right, the next section is invisible item showcase. So I'll show you where that would be. It would be this part here, item showcase. So say if you've got a nice pin you want to, or a nice CSGO skin that you want to put somewhere in the middle, you put it either side, just like that. It's just this thing here. Throw out the end, paste. That's normal, right? It's just a simple emoticon, which you can just slap in the showcase and it just puts it like that. It's a few quid, but it works. Gets the job done. All right, in the next section, I'll show you how to turn this by into this by removing this section here so it's this part here instead of having the url you have this whole bit here url equals and then you put the url there and they both they both redirect to the exact same place they just doesn't have that extra section there so say you don't want your display badge anymore which is this thing right here you go to this URL, which will bring you right here. And then you copy all of this. Come back, right click, inspect. Go to the console. Just paste in there. Enter. Scroll down, save. Go back to your Steam profile. Right click, reload. There you go. It's not there. Copy the URL. Open up incognito. Paste in my profile. Yeah, see, it's not there. If you want an invisible name, come here, click Control A, Control C, back to your profile, edit profile, go back to your name, profile name, paste, scroll down, save, there, you have no name. If you want an invisible profile picture, come to one of these links, copy it, paste, click it, save, and now you will have no more picture. Right, this next one, I'll show you. Go all the way down to my bottom of my profile. It's all of these Steam emoticons on the game collector. All it is is this. Select it all, copy, 
I go to my profile quickly. Edit profile. Go down to the bottom of the featured showcase. Right click inspect. You go down. Find it. Console. Paste it in. Press enter. And then click save. I go back to my profile. Oh, I have no name. Ooh. Go right to the bottom. Here, it'll be there. Which is quite neat. There are some other nice ones too. So different app IDs will give you different icons in games, which is pretty nice. All right, after fixing my profile, I'll show you how to make some cool emotes, like emoticon little emoji things, which would be quite neat. Post, yeah, stuff like that. I have some ones saved, which I've made. Some of them are taken from somewhere, but the majority are made by myself, which I think is quite neat. This section here is just a gap, which you can place there instead of having something else. But if you click fetch, come to this website, click fetch, theme ID, bank canvas, width 9, height doesn't really matter. And then you simply just, you know, draw around, you know, it's quite neat. And put some cool dudes. Click export. Now bring up the same copy. Open up a notepad. Open it. Paste it there. Come back to this. This one at the top there. Copy that. A minute. And you just remove the outside bits. As long as you want them to be removed, so there'd be like a hollow bit. So I wanted the stuff in between the legs removed. The sections under the beak, side by the beak. And if you get it advanced enough you can make some other ones you just put up a cool one quickly our oh, pumpkin here we go this is the one i wanted because it's nearly halloween this is what will happen if you paste it and you don't own it don't own one of the emoticons so select the emoticon you want minimize that come to this website click hub go to emoticons check it out paste in there it will bring it bring it up there click on it and here it is i can buy it and buy it right now Place order. And you buy that. All right, cool. Copy the entire thing again. Delete that comment. Paste again. There you go. Uh, finally, I'm going to show you how to comment to all your friends. Come to here. Copy that. Paste it in. Bring up all your friends. And this entire thing here. Copy that. Go back. Right click. Inspect. Console, paste, and bring up all your people who you're friends with. So, write a nice comment, all, but none. Select some people you don't want, or you do want. Or then take up some people you don't. Write them a nice message, click post. The best way to instantly make your profile look better, you go to store, point store. Go down to, you got the seasonal profile, stuff like that, it's quite nice. Make it look fancy. Or your game profiles, we think's the best. They cost ten thousand each, so they're not cheap. But let's say, but I'll pick the Valve one. View my profile. Edit profile. Uh, what's it gonna be? Special profile. Put it on. I'll put the Hades on just for my profile. Save. Avatar. The avatar as. Ooh. Let's put the fire one to make this really, really stand out. Background. Oh, where's the fire one? This will really. Oh, here we go. Profile. Look at that. Right, pretend I have an artwork which doesn't have these annoying different colors. But yeah, it adds some nice spice. If I wanted an invisible section at one of these corners or wherever I want in the achievement showcase, um, you go to here, install Sam. You just Google how to install Sam. Open it up. Search for 480, add, double click that, click that, commit, so you have the achievement now. And then, when you find the one you want to change, right click, inspect, scroll down to where you find it, slot 16, 17, 18. So when I hover over it, it shows where it's going to change. And then where the app ID is, you just double click, delete that section, type 480, press enter. And then when you save the profile, it'll be changed and now it will have an invisible section.